So today, I'm going to show you what you have to do every time Red Dead Redemption is updated. Now, obviously this is for the VR mod. Because every now and again, Rockstar is going to update this game and you're not going to be able to play it in VR. You're going to have to do what I'm going to show you what to do now. First and foremost, obtain the rollback files. Now you should all already have these from the first time you install the mod. But if you haven't, the way to get them, you can either use mine, which I've included in the description, a link to these. These are mine from, from my, uh, my account. I don't know if they'll work on your game, but they work on my game. Or you can use the console method, which, uh, well, I'll show you how to do that in the first video that I've done. I'll put a link for that here, and that's the video about installing the mod. You don't need to do that, install the mod. All you have to do, if the game's been updated and it no longer works, is go to your Steam account. Select Red Dead Redemption 2, right-click on it, and you'll get this little drop-down here. Go to manage, go to browse local files. We'll just close this down so we can see that. And there are the local files. And all you have to do is take this, right click on it and extract here. So I'm, in, uh, I'm extracting that, sorry, in a, its own little folder that I've created for it. Won't take long. There you go. So, yeah, that's all of them. I don't need this. I'm just going to move that out of the way for convenience. I'm going to make sure that I'm nowhere near these folders because I don't want to drop any of this into one of these folders by accident. So I'm going to move this down here, give us some room. I'm going to select all these. Like that. I'm going to drag them over to this folder. And this is your games folder. And there's the address for it. Steam library, Steam apps, common, Red Dead Redemption 2. Just drop them there. Replace files. And you want to click yes to that. That's going to replace all these files. The update files, shader, and these here. And then what you need to do is go to real config. Now this is from your installation of the mod. If you want to reinstall the mod, you can do that. Uh, I'll put a link to that mod again in the description. But you shouldn't have to do. Just click on this. And this will happen. And then this, it's asking me if I want to keep the files that I had before and uh, before the update. And the answer is no, I don't. So I want to delete them. I'm going to press D on my keyboard. Like that. And now it's going to ask me, do I want it ultra, high, medium, low, or optimized? Well, I'm going to choose medium on my keyboard. Of course, I'm going to press M, and then I'm going to press any key to continue because it's done all that for me. And that, that should have done it. That should be fixed. So let's see if it is. This is just after the March update, the end of March they updated it. It was a force update and it broke it for a lot of people. So let's play and I'll show you my settings because I'm going to go into settings before I start the game itself. <sighs> let's hope this works. Now, if it doesn't work, I'm sorry, I just can't help you. And this is only for the Steam version. I can't make any promises for any other version of the game. If you bought it on Steam and you're playing it through Steam, it should work. This is what should happen. This is normal. Here we go. There you go. I'm with it. And as you can see... This will pop up and you want to press pause on your on your keyboard and this is build one four three six if it says anything other than one four three six where build comes up in the corner there then you've done something wrong uh, i'm going to go into settings first 
because I want to make sure in graphics, or oh, not only on graphics, that certain things are turned off. That'll do. I want triple buffering off. I don't want buffering, I just don't want it. Uh, and I want this. I don't want texture quality ultra, I want it at medium. And I want this anthropic filtering. And it's, I don't know how to pronounce that. Anyway, I want that off. Shadow quality. Yeah, we'll keep it at medium. Have a look down it. All these are at medium. Off. Uh, T double A is I. I'm going to leave that at I. Everything else is at medium. So that's more or less, I'm happy with that. Yes, I want to keep those settings. So let's see if it works. Ooh. Turn off head bobbin as well. That's always a good idea. Uh, story mode, I've already turned it off. Ooh. So I'm running this on a, a 3060, and that's why I put everything at medium. If you've got a decent PC, if you've got a more powerful PC than that, which most people have, well not most people, but certainly a lot of people who are going to be running this game will have. Uh, you can set it, you can set it everything to high, or choose that optimi uh, optimize setting. Right, so I won't go anywhere now until I press on me. Look at this, isn't it lovely? And it's on medium, it looks gorgeous. Now, if you press pause, this little thing will pop up. And then what you do, use your mouse and go to advanced. And you see this, this is a alternate eye rendering. I don't like that. I always turn that to mono. Apparently you, you lose some of the 3D depth, but as far as I'm concerned, it's just much better. I don't notice the 3D depth thing. This is much better. Press pause again, get rid of that. There we are. And if you press F5, this comes up, and you have to use the numpad to navigate this. But it's a little uh, trainer, and you can get all kinds of shite. Change the weather and everything. And get loads of money if you want that. So anyway, that's we'll press F5 again to get rid of that. So here we are, we're at the train station. Should I shoot somebody? No, no Michael, don't shoot anybody. Just have a look round. This is a little bit of gameplay. You've already seen the setting, so you don't have to see them. Again, do you? Isn't it gorgeous? There goes that ass wife now. Is that a fact? Is he talking about me? Hello? Hello? Sure enough. Yeah. Ain't you done pawing around for trouble? I better move on. I don't want any trouble. I want to catch a train. Hey, move it! Oh, that's him. <sighs> good morning. Did he just say good morning? Good morning. Are you alright? You had a bad day. Why in the hell are you so close to me? Uh, I don't know. I'll, I'll step back. What's your problem? I haven't got a problem. I'm down here. Everybody's really nasty. Should I kill somebody? I wanted to catch a train, but if people are going to start messing about and disrespecting me, hey, Mister, need a ride? Before you shoot your damn foot off. Who, who says? Okay, shoot him, partner. In the air. You got this all wrong, you goddamn fool! Okay. 
I shouldn't have done that, should I? Is there a train coming? I could do it with a train. to calm down. Where's that Don't train? Who's talking to me now? I'm telling you, get them hands up or you're done for! Don't need talking to me. Oh, shit. oh this guy here. He's not dying, is it? Now he's dead. Still no train coming. Oh, oh dear. So that that is what happens when you break the law. What's happening now? Oh, I've got loads of money. Am I back at my... Oh, I'm back here. Good morning. Good morning. Ooh. Hello. Hmm. See, they're not that friendly here. And these are supposed to be my friends. Should I just get on it? Should I, uh. I wanted to get on a train, to be honest with you. Because I've had pinched this horse, because I know it's not mine. Where's my. This, yes, it is mine, actually. Okay, let's get away from here. Come on. I want to see a train, at least see a train, because they look quite, well, they look pretty awesome in this game, trains. I know that sounds like a stupid thing to say, but that's what I do. I say stupid things. Oh, a train line. I am just so full of shit. Some of you just gonna have to get used to. Oh, it's a little town village kind of place. There might be a train down here. Ooh. I'm not in trouble here. Is this a place I've just been killing people? Yeah, because there's a bounty out for me. Let's get off. And let's go and pay my bounty. to this oh well he's not here so I can't do I think he's not here because he's dead if I remember rightly I killed him didn't I oh, and I wanted to buy a ticket this time you know do everything proper damn way. just get out of my way hey eyes front no, no train. Look, I'm going to leave it there. What's that? Because I need something to eat. But that's how you fix the updates. Isn't that easy? That piece of piss? You just copy the rollback files over again, like you did the first time you installed. And then just click on the uh, real config file that comes with the mod. 
and it should fix it so it looks like this and this looks pretty good I'm I'm happy with this should I kill them people over there where's my rifle 